Ti. In order to unplug, there are two parts. One is the mechanical part. See, this you have to push it down and pull it out. But now it doesn't work. Why it doesn't work? There's another part electronically you have to unlock. I see here. So you have to unlock here electronically. See, now I have a 77%. See, this says the plug is locked and I have 70 some percent charge, I charge 30 minutes, I want to stop. I'll push the stop button here, but you see, it's a use your phone to authorize this charger. So it doesn't unlock it unless the proper owner will do it. So the way to do it is use either your phone or the RFID. See, if I do this, it says, verifying you are allowed to stop the charging it says okay please disconnect the plug and return to the holder now i come back to here i, I undo this okay now it's undone and i put it back see here's a connector lock that's another theme you cannot pull out the old connector because the the client is locked you have to push stop and then the connector will be unlocked let's do this uh, stop I try to stop. Are you sure you want to stop charge? It says yes. Terminating charge. And see connector is connected unlocked. See now it's unlocked and uh, I hear a click sound and you push this, this unlatch. This is the one unlatch. Now you pull out. If you do this, we we'll get that latched on. How do you disconnect? There are two things. One is this, you pull it back like this. And the other is uh, press on the top. Press, move this like this, and then press here. You just pull it out. Remove it easy, you just do this. One hand is here, one hand is push on the top. And now you can release it like that. If someone press this, say emergency stop, and this doesn't work, and you have to turn clockwise to unrelease it. See? Now clockwise, and now come back. You just need to press this to, to recycle. See? Now it's all set. Say thank you, bye. So this is how it works. You press this and then go in, you have to turn clockwise, a quarter clockwise, and then keep pressing the stop, it will reset. That's how you do it. And if it doesn't work, you can always have this switch on the back. 